My name is Grace, and I'm a naturalist here at Baltimore Woods Nature Center in Marcellus, New York. And I'm very excited today because we're talking about insects. And I love insects. I just can't get enough of them. Whether they're flying in the air or swimming in the water, I think they're pretty fantastic. Now, one reason I admire insects is that they are foundational to many food webs found throughout the world. Insects in all their shapes and sizes serve an important purpose to the ecosystems and habitats that we hold dear. Today, I'm at Phillips Pond and I got my trusty net and my trusty bucket so that we can observe one of my favorite aquatic insects. Now, if you're ready, let's get going. Ah yes, my favorite, the predaceous diving beetle of the order Coleoptera and family Didicidae. Predaceous diving beetle larvae have long cylindrical bodies and pronounced pincers right near the top of their bodies, by their eyes. They can be up to two inches in length. Predaceous diving beetle larvae are also known as the water tiger because they're voracious predators. Larvae eat other aquatic creatures like tadpoles and even small fish. They are known as lurkers that sit in the water and wait for prey to pass them by. They grab onto prey with their pincers and use a special sickle-shaped mouth part to inject chemicals into their body. These chemicals liquefy the insides and then the larva will slurp those insides out, sort of like a smoothie. They wouldn't make great dinner guests, but wow, how fascinating. Although these creatures may be fierce predators in their local food chain, animals like bigger fish, birds, and mammals simply think these water tigers are irresistible morsels. The larva eventually metamorphose into the adult predaceous diving beetle. The predaceous diving beetle can range in color from black to gold and can be up to 1.5 inches in length. These beetles are fierce predators. They eat prey like tadpoles and mosquito larvae. They're known as chewers because they tear apart their food before eating it. Even though they're all grown up, these predaceous diving beetles don't mature to become ideal dinner guests. Just like in its larval stage, although the predaceous diving beetle is fearsome in its local food chain, they make a tasty snack for animals such as birds and mammals. Whether predaceous diving beetles are doing the eating or are someone's next meal, these insects play an important role in the food webs here at Baltimore Woods and beyond. Well, I hope you enjoyed learning about the predaceous diving beetle today. There's always so much fascinating stuff to learn about the creatures that we share this earth with. If you're feeling inspired by this video, please check us out on our social media accounts, on YouTube, and online at baltimorewoods.org. Have a great day, everybody. And remember, insects are cool.